three years ago. Um, in St. Louis, it had this thing called high speed music. It's kind of like it's, it's kind of got the elements of drill music, but it's more so about you know the selling drugs and the highlight of it is high speed and getting away from police and things like that. Um, it's you know starting to get his big but I know Say Cheese kind of talks about it on his channel here and there on his platform here and there. Um, do you think something like that could be just as impactful as drill music to the? No. Oh. Uh. Just selling drugs and running from the police. Uh, nah, that's gonna stay in St. Louis. That's just like the Kill Boys ain't went nowhere, but what the Kill Boys do? Ain't nobody down here kid, kid running away with Kill because it's stupid. Uh, who hustle and wanna run from the police? How they make, who, it must, these must be middle school, elementary school kids writing the lyrics. We go hustle, sell dope, and run from the police. Well, you ain't gonna have money long. Why do you even wanna get the police attention while you're hustling? Go to speed limit, put your seatbelt on, you can have your license, your insurance, don't smoke weed in the car, none of that. What happened to those rules? What happened to those rules, young brothers? That's why you niggas ain't thriving. That's why you niggas ain't, ain't that's why the young, y'all don't have no direction. There, somebody either misguiding this group or this group will perish, and the kids up under them will be the next great black people. This, these are the rotten apples of black people that have to die off. There's nothing that God can do with those 30 and under. And I'm telling you, I fuck with these guys. They don't know how to pray. What's going to happen when that white boy get one of them and put them on 23-hour lockdown? Well, who are we going to call out to? They don't know a God. They can't recite no scriptures. They don't know our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom. I knew that as a kid. Having suicidal thoughts on 24-hour lockdown. Kicking on the door. My nigga hung himself. Mm. He couldn't take it. You was young when you went in. We were babies, homie. Yeah. But we were playing gangster. Listening to this shit you just telling me, hustling and running from the police. We didn't give a damn about getting no money. We throw rocks at the police, take off running, somebody going to jail. Didn't get nine dollar. Steal a car, see the police, hit the gas, ah! and didn't get not one dollar. So, homie, this is the generation of kids. They going to hell. They don't have no connection to God. This the scariest group of black people I ever seen because they don't know God, homie. They got the Hebrews, they got the more, they got everybody telling them about a God and can't nobody show them what God looked like in the manifestations of a human. Grandmama coming down to the court, standing up in court, saying to the judge, Yana, and, 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 and the judge seeing your mom, your grandmama's God, nigga ain't giving you favor because of your grandmama. Your mama coming down to the prison and the prison people seeing your mama pray with you before y'all leave visitation and they treating you different because of your mama. They know you a bull. You see what I'm saying? They don't have this. Our black kids don't have no protection. You don't even have nobody standing in the gap for them and God. They just on their own. They, standing their way out homie, they, they Listen. They have to go to jail and they have to die because it ain't nothing God can do with them. Why you think it's so many young people dying today? We ain't never seen this before. We ain't never seen young. They have to because it ain't nothing God can do with these hearts of young people because of the fruit that they come from. The seed and the fruit is all the same. Sit your up down. Some of these little ain't mm -hmm. never had a hug from Big Mama. They grandmama said, I ain't, I'm too young to be a guy. Grandmama, call me, me, Ma. Don't call me, Grandmama. Grandmama ain't want to be young. Don't even want to be called Grandmama. Not real. Shit. <laughs> so nigga, you can't just go up and lay your head on the chip. Why? What the fuck you want? Why I'm ticking you, got kid? I know y'all be having your mama come get you. They being rejected like straight off. Get away, bro. Get. Nobody's hugging and nurturing and breathing life into these little black motherfuckers, homie. So this is what I'm saying. Get out the way of God. Go get the ones that ain't got no problems. The ones with the problems. If you let them get 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 with that anger and that hate and it reaches their body size, they'll hurt you for trying to correct them. They'll hurt you for trying to correct them. Real shit. <laughs> That's scripture. Fools hate to be corrected. 
Say, pull your pants up, little homie. You talking to me for? Say, come on, homie. Fools hate to be corrected. So that's why we're seeing so many young people. If children mimic what they see and repeat what they hear. So if you want to look at black children and look at the problem of black children, go look at the black social media platforms and see what the adult black people are doing on the social media platform. And then you'll see why the black children are the way they are. They are mimicking the same behaviors. We just not killing one another, but we killing one another's souls and spirits on these lines and, and apps, mm -hmm. social media platforms.